Hi everyone and welcome to my channel. Today it's about gardening and pest control. You know you can spray a lot of things, chemical, non-chemical, and that's for sure a discussion, but you can also ju just uh, work with beasts against the beasts. So the pest control is insects against insects. Some eat others that you don't want. So for example, aphids, you might know that ladybugs love to eat them. So often people buy ladybugs to uh, work with those. Of course, they can also fly away, so better you buy the larvae or the eggs. Um, but they're rather expensive. And what I'm showing you here, shri sopa or something, how it's called, these are like, you might have seen them, little green flies with transparent glass-like wings. And the benefit to this one is that they eat aphids, but also other things that might be pests on your plants. So like little spiders and little flies and things like that. So it's cheaper and a broadband spectrum um, pest control. Now they are in this box, which is only to be stored a day or two in the fridge. And you sprinkle them over the plants. It's a little tricky for small plants because then there is wind, etc. and very small leaves on the, my uh, red berries. So you can also make or buy little bags like here. And you hang them in the plants and they crawl out of it. You can make them out of uh, coffee filters like it's showing here. I made some out of paper and now that I look outside I see why it's possibly not super smart because then the water will stay in there. So I did it like this. I thought I make a square and I put a little bit in here and I hang it to the leaf and then there will be able to crawl out here. It, I think it should still work. The best thing to do, which I saw, is if a leaf would already be hanging in that little back that they could crawl directly onto the leaf. Best scenario, of course, an infested leaf. But I'm going to do both. I'm going to sprinkle and I'm going to hang little, little bags. And yeah, unfortunately, I wanted to buy them when there is rather sunny weather. And now I have multiple days of rain. So that's something you should consider. Um, yeah, they're not cheap, so I don't want to let them go to waste. And I'm going to show you how they look like. Okay, I'm going to put it on some white paper. I open it up and this comes on some, it's very diff carrier kind of material. These are obviously not the bugs, but it's food and um, the things that you sprinkle. And you can see that they're partially open. So I'm assuming they're sitting in there. You also should keep this uh, sidewards. And before you put it, roll it a little bit, I guess, and it distributes a little bit better. But they are very, very, very small. So yeah, I don't think we can really see them. And I'm gonna put some in there. <laughs> And then some, just some, and then over the leaves. And I think you could eventually put the plastic back over it if it's windy. Um, normally you don't sprinkle them on the soil directly, but if you have like five plants like I am, I'm gonna just sprinkle it in everywhere. And I'm hoping that this is gonna work. Yeah, just wanted to show you this because it's a really good alternative to ladybugs more broadband and applied can be applied easier so thanks for watching